There's Mr. Watermelon, guys. I miss the watermelon. Okay, we just woke up. It's one o'clock in the afternoon. I'm extremely bleeding hangover. Too much vodka and about 30, 40 euro worth of pizza I bought for some reason. I don't know why. I was really, really drunk. For some reason, I'm drunk. I just buy a fucking lot of food. I haven't eaten pizza in such a long time. What's wrong with me? Situation is today we're going to go to a mosque. Um, I'll see Kazakhstan again. I'm not sure what we're gonna do because my head is a bit messed up at the moment, so I really don't know what's going on. Enjoy, I'm gonna show you around the town again. If I, I, if it's starting now, well, that's the situation. I'm losing track of what day it is. I think it's day three. Ugh, my head is so sore, man. <sighs> Jesus, okay. So tell me what you want, tell me how you want it, tell me all the reasons that you're running. I think we really get very lucky with the weather to be honest. Oh my god, I think we just arrived at the biggest mosque in Dana, Kazakhstan, the biggest mosque. So we're gonna have a quick look around and see what it's like. I've been to many mosques in the past. They're fascinating architectures and structures, I have to say. So I'm gonna have a quick look inside. It looks beautiful already. Front door. I just wanna be with you. I just wanna be with you. The mosque here and uh no. it's had some food. No. The food was extremely cheap I have to say. Like I made, I made like one fifty for like a few portions of food. I think it's gonna buy something else because it's so cheap. Yeah. This is my first time to be in a Muslim country so I also don't know much about it. Would this be uh, traditional? Maybe, yeah. I'd say so. Yeah you can say so. <laughs> yeah. So I just paid like twenty cents for that and it's, it's Pretty impressive. Holy shit. So guys, we're back in route. We had this is Independent Square. It's the main square of Astana. It's it's massive. Like we have so many landmarks around it. Like. It's pretty cool to stand right in the middle here. There's nobody around, like it's crazy. Empty, like ghost town. What's going on? We have all these like futuristic looking buildings though. We have the nice big pyramid here. The great mosque behind us. That's that's beautiful. Beautiful mosque. I went inside, but there's nothing special inside, but I just I like the architecture outside. It's my favourite part. And then we have Carl Butler here, my little friend. Boop! And then uh, yeah! I gotta get some drone footage here now. I'm gonna bring the drone up. It's safe enough, a secure area, so yeah, should be okay. So I hope you enjoyed the drone footage of Independence Square and here's a... Uh, he actually looks like a Russian, I know, I know, he does look like a Russian. He blends right in the Kazakhstan. <laughs> but we're going to the most eco-friendly mall in the world now. There's an inside uh, beach, do you believe it or not, with a tropical climate at 35 degrees with tropical trees as well. So we're going to try that out. I think. That's going to cost about 15 or 20 euro to get into the beach. But it'll be a weird experience going to the beach and so on. So we're going to check it out. Hopefully it's not closed. It's 6 p.m. in the evening now. So we'll see you there. So an inside beach, yeah, we're going in, we're in the mall and there's an inside beach which is fucking crazy, so I want to try it out, it looks awesome with the photos, so.
Okay, that's us finished um, here. Awesome place, I have to say. And um, we're gonna meet up with the guy that we booked the Airbnb off. He's gonna drive us around the town for the night. Um, I don't know, I don't know what to expect. He just told us he's gonna pick us up and show us around. So I'm just gonna go with the flow and see what happens. Yeah. How team was a tour. Everybody in the future knows. And when we came to the Roman Empire. Yeah, like that. I, I will 